Alrighty then, welcome back everyone to some more Mother Thress. So, um, let's see, chapter 3 has ended, we have saved Apu, well, not really, I guess I kinda made myself be accidentally saved, not have Apu be totally safe, you know, launch did something, that's all that pretty much matters. So we're gonna be starting st chapter 4, and uh, this is where the game pretty much starts, since this, like, three chapters were only just, I guess, an intro? So what we're going to be uh, seeing? Yes, I looked at I looked at a walkthrough just so I could see how fa how like far or how how long this game is, and it's pretty decent length. So let's continue going. Let's delete our save file. No, let's continue. It's crazy. That's a crazy ooh music. All right. There's the brothers. Brothers. Oh wow, he's marching in place. Oh. Uh, so this is the day when they went to go see their mother at her grave. And then he runs away. Oh, come on. And then becomes king of the dinos and owns those guys. Look at that. Boom! Bite your head! Bye! And then he's gonna get Mario or Wario, either one. Then his dad is chilling there with his mama at the grave, looking at their mother's grave. Dad says, get the hell up, stop crying. Takes his hat and leaves. I know they're longer than you. <laughs> no more tears, only dreams. Chapter 4, Club Titaboo. Does that say Club Titty Boo? What? Oh, uh, it's Raymond. Bad omens come with rain. And who knew train cars were so little? They're too little. Three years later, Tasmali Village. Wow, I would change that much from being a little farming town into this gigantic, I'm guessing, economic town since there's a railroad there. Everyone's got the white picket fences, the white walls to keep keep the keep that guy who lives in a tent out of there. Oh no, those aren't walls; those are sidewalks. Oh. <laughs> I guess that guy doesn't care about his monkey, but he's still turning people over, huh? So Luna's three years older. So how old would he be? He would be thirteen, right? And wasn't he ten or seven in the series? I'm a baby. All right, let's see. My DP. Dick Pressure? Dallas Page? The Pearls. Easy Grip Stick. Car Sticked with Easy Grip. Alright, got that. What was. Uh, what? Aww. Oh, he's remembering Mama brushing her hair. His hair. <gasps> Mama, I miss you! <laughs> I like the music. A fireplace and firewood. Atticus shoes and a scrap of cough from Aurora's dress are stored in here with care. So Gaia kept them. <laughs> Ever since Mom died, the food's been shit. No problem here. Ah! Wild animals are afraid of lightning, but Livestar are actually pretty okay with it. Woof! I could take you for a walk if you like. <laughs> what? Buddy! Buddy joined our group. Yeah, buddy! Yeah, buddy. Oh, it'd take me for a walk. Ah! Lightning is scary. Smile. What the fuck? Ah! I got charred a charred black smile. Oh, so lightning struck here. What? Oh, so excuse me. So their fur got burnt off because of it. Hello. Hey, you there, boy. I realize this might be a little bit of bother, but please come talk to me. 
A very important information for you. No! Stay there! Why the fuck? Oh. From this day forth, you'll be rewarded for your hard work. I'll be giving in units called DP Dragon Power. Uh, you can use DP in shops and the other places in exchange for goods and services. It seems you already earned 30 DP so far. You can save and draw DP any time talking to nearby frogs. Some frogs in special locations cannot conduct DP transactions, though. Shall I explain all that again? Alright, no. Okay, I get that. Alright then, let's try it out. Time certainly flies, doesn't it? Cop, do you need something? Yes. Uh, do you need to do and perhaps to, uh, let me save my game so I can have this nice, wonderful picture. Yay, Luna and... Oh, oh fuck buddy, right? Now hold it on using the bathroom. What? DDP stuff. Withdraw? And I got deposit, but I guess I'll withdraw. How do I... I just do that. You're holding out on savings, but I hope you're not holding out on using the bathroom, too. What the fuck? Hey, you! Frog creature! Fuck you! So this is Taz Millie's famous lightning house. It's really incredible. It was definitely worth coming all the way to see it. Oh, lightning house. Oh, so lightning struck here, huh? You must really love being unhappy if you still refuse to get a happy box after all this. This is a simple atmosphere, the smell of livestock and sea breeze. It's the only part of Tasmania Village that hasn't changed a bit in the past three years. Alright, so where's the- oh, look at that. I guess Gaia has been fighting the change that's been happening to this town. Did you, uh, think so much beauty would blossom up in three years? Huh? What? Am I talking about myself? No, of course not, I'm talking about Tasmily! Uh, my dad is working over to the factory, so he left me in charge of the store. Would you like to buy something? <sighs> Sprinting bomb, Pisces, kid's hat, kid shirt. That shit's fucking flapping like a crazy. Alright, nothing crazy here. It's a little different, obviously. Move, please. Check all the houses! Everything! An oven is hurting iron red hot. This is a very latest automated model. The happy box is giving off wobbling sorts of sound. What is this, a flat screen TV? No problem here, there's a flat screen TV and yet a box typed uh, monitor. I'm not happy with this. Thomas's shop, offering fascinating big city items faster and greater quantities than anyone else. There are, uh, things are different now, don't forget to bring DP. Dragon points, at least that sounds good. Uh, the Outer Wind has so much more warmth and friendliness up until three years ago. Really now? The DMC band has a bassist named Lucky. He seems a little bu he seems a little bum like. Apparently he's a real good performer. No problem here. Our Yado Inn has changed so much to gain so much new customers. Even uh since Mr. Facade came to town. Ever since Mr. Facade came to town. Uh they say the village has no happy boxes until three years ago. Tuh. I wonder what the happy boxes did. This whole total poster girl was so cute. I wonder what her name is. Oh, I didn't talk to the guy at the front desk. Welcome! You're non-staying guest, yes? Alright. Did I talk to these guys? You're the type that just has to talk to everyone, aren't you? No, no, no. I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I think that's exact actually a very important thing to do. I heard that you uh they used to raise cows and pigs where the uh training facility to south this now. Mr. Facade brought uh bought up all the land there. Ah. Happy box is giving off a light of some Oh, I didn't even see that box right there. Trivia card. Trivia card. A card with uh with an obscure trivia question on it. Try using it on human enemies. Oh. I wonder what kind of shit that is. It's it's a weird item. It looks like it'll hurt them in some way, maybe. Attention guests staying here at group work retreats. Please talk in a whispered voices when conducting meetings. Thank you. No. I shall yell. Be like, fuck you me! Fuck you mean! Uh why'd you come in here? What was your reason? One, because I'm an anonymity. Two, you can flirt with me. Three, because you like me. But four, other. Which is it? Damn, bitch. You don't have to get so fucking shit. Whisper, whisper. What do you want for lunch? Whisper, whisper. Just anything but pasta. But that pasta. Whisper, whisper. Croquette rolls are fine with me. No, actually, that's what I prefer. 
Whisper, whisper. But we should uh, keep going until we find a good place to stop. Uh, I'm in a luxury hotel, but surprisingly enough, I'm not acting nervous. Have you noticed? <sighs> it's because my back pocket's filled with money I earned at the factory. Factory, huh? I'm about to go on a walk with my grandkid to the Cerulean Beach. Uh, it'd be like old man on the beach and all that. Ho ho ho! Hey boo. Sniffle. Grandpa and I are supposed to go to, uh, to the beach after I change into my swimsuit, but I can't take my eyes off the happy box, Sniffle. Huh. I guess it's like some kind of hypnosis device, I'm guessing? It's funny how they only added one room. <laughs> what the hell? What does this say? We mean no problem here. There's a problem here. There's a sign. There's a sign right here. All right. Oh no, thing. Oh hey there, Luna. I hear your dad's still hiking up in the mountains looking for Atticus. You should really tell him yourself that it's about time to give up already. Why? Oh hello there, Luna. You look a bit down in the dumps. The happy box would really change your life, you know. Oh Luna, hi. Allie? Whenever I listen to Mr. Facade talk, I suddenly want everything. It's almost like he's a magician. Giggle. Huh. Lightning struck Reggie's tent, but uh, that's what he gets for not having a happy box. So he did that thing on purpose. Notice, our humble little shop, Caroline's Bakery, has also adopted a wonderful new DP system. What the? You need something? Yeah. What the? Dude got a car! I'm so fresh. You're so cool. Wow, look at this. Oh, welcome, Luna. Fuel's been helping out around the store lately. He's a real lifesaver. Oh, you're here to buy something? What can I get you? Nut bread, peculiar cheese, fresh milk. Alright, this is all the stuff you can find, except a red roll. That was a new one. Uh, I love helping people out. Alright, you're a good guy. You're a good guy. Potato-like men are my, are my type. What?! I'm shaped like a potato. Hey, baby. Man, they purposely strike this tank. This village sure has a lot of lightning lately. Pay attention now. Listen, let's just be a lesson. Punishment falls on the homes of all bad guys. Out of the way, out of the way. Gah, you're annoying. Shoot, gang, shoot, get. The lightning used to Reggie's bread, but now the lightning is back to Reggie. That's because they attacked you purposely. This didn't change. There's people in here? I got busted for larceny. Well, all I do is pick up a doorknob and found on the ground. This isn't fair. Huh? Where's the doorknob now? How should I know? Maybe it was sent to the forensic lab or something. Oh wow. Looks like I've been arrested, but I actually came in here on my own. I don't care what anyone says. I'm not coming out. <laughs> what? Please don't stare directly at me. It might make me want to arrest you. Why? These guys are dicks. The village used to have no uh, policemen at all. You gotta be kidding me. Come on! You gotta be kidding me. So this was kind of like, I guess, Pleasantville, perfect town, nothing wrong until a uh, thing called money came in and made everything bad. Some moron by the name of Guy busted the lock on the store, so now I have to stand here like to hold it shut. Well, use your money to, to fix it, how about that? Oh! A re reggae rhythm? What the fuck was that? What the hell did I just open? I don't know what it was! Can someone explain it to me? A dolphin osicle. A dolphin osicle. What the hell? There is a problem there. I'll save you- what is that, a pig? That woman over there, she keeps looking this way. I wonder if she likes me. Oh, I'm so nervous, thump thump. Man, I bet she likes me. Hey, baby, how you doing? The suit-shaped swimsuit is pretty sweet, huh? That is highly illogical. These appear to be pig mask shoes. Oh, that's what they're called? Pig mask? 
No drinking, no swimming, no swimming, no drinking. And swimming while hallucinating is absolutely out of the question. Why? Oink. When I just lie here like this, I can forget about all the bad things in my life. <laughs> I don't like beaches. That man over there, he keeps looking this way. I wonder if he likes me. Oh, I'm so nervous. Thump, thump. Hey, you guys should bring each other together. What's up, frog? My homie. You're my homie. Oh. Has the time on my thing not changed? What's up? What's good? Outside, taking your dog for a walk? You must really think you have someone special. I, uh, you think you're someone special. Seriously, you don't even work. Even kids are working at the factory nowadays, you know. What the fuck? Oh, Luna, do you still have the happy box at home? No. Look, everything in here has been totally modernized. Well, at least a little bit more. Come on, buddy. Let's go. These people are crazy. There's something across the sea. Do you ever wonder about such things? Please call me anytime. Johnny. It would probably be best if you didn't talk to me. Got that? No. Are you really sure? Everyone hates me, you know. They all say I talk too much and never shut up. Are you sure you don't want to turn back now? Don't turn back. Do you know what a trumpet is? I was actually thinking about learning how to play the trumpet, but I didn't. It's not that I was bad at it or anything. That's just how it was destined to be. Do you know what destiny is? Destiny? If you do, that's, that's cool. My destiny just didn't cross the destiny of trumpets, that's all. But thanks to that, my, uh, my tit not taking up the trumpet. I could use the time I would have spent practicing on other things. It's money of looking at it. It's not like I'm doing something wrong here. Yeah. I'll start something else, and who knows, maybe that'll turn out well. Like, maybe I could start practicing the, uh, Yonopi. Do you know what Yonopi is? It's a proper turn for a piano. What if I start practicing a Yonopi now? A Yonopi, I don't know. I'd, I'd wind up being the greatest Yonopi ever. Charming the hearts of men in the world over. I never heard of that word. Uh, if that if that happens, I mean, it was right about everything, wouldn't it? My fate, uh, my fate still uh, hasn't kissed Yonopi's fate of the crosswalk just yet. But nobody knows what the future holds. Not even mole crickets, water striders, or horned owls. Hey, you smile. Yes, you have a really cute smile. You know that? So anyway, basically. <laughs> And so Luna grew. <laughs> uh, you should have turned back when you had the chance. Oh, come on. I like that. Ooh, sexy lady. Nice scenery. How about some nice love? Please call me anytime. <laughs> what the hell? That couple on the other bench has been really lovey dovey dovey for a while now. But they just won't leave. I don't know what the deal is. Amore. That's love. Love. That's amore. Alelore, how much I love you! We're trying to be lovey-dovey, please don't bother us. Why don't you go get some love too, man? Man, do love! Bang, bang! Uh, let's see. He's the most happening dude here! Alright, let's see. That guy looks so plain, you don't deserve a girlfriend. You're done. You're not interesting. In the old days, we sent letters by pigeon, and now, uh, look how we do things. By mail? <laughs> I don't have no fucking idea. Most of the shit I check out in anyone's houses really doesn't do anything. Uh, I guess we'll go to the right. I mean, the left. Oh, God. No problem here. What do you mean there's a hole here? Notice, beware of snakes. Please refrain from practicing comedy routines in this area. Greetings, lumbar people. There is a problem there. There's a hole there. I don't like this. You're lying to me. God damn it. I'm guessing I could sell these or something? What do these do? Fossilized uh, ossicle of a dolphin and uh, ossicle is an earbone. Ossicle. Earbone. Earbone? Gross. Why would I have that on me? That's gross. Fuck you, pig head! Uh... What the fuck? Oh, there we go. Well, that's easy to sell stuff here. I guess that's the easy way to get, like, $5 or something. I'll talk to that guy, but I kind of want to look around first. 
If we need something for the map loving maps and maps and the map, yeah, so I can talk about the non-stop map stuff, you know? Old Man West is definitely gonna go bald. Yes, there's no doubt about it. Bald definitely. <laughs> is there anyone here who puts money on this thing? Because I just did anyway. If you have extra money, please put it in here. From the trustworthy and benevolent mayor pusher. Pusher? They have a mayor now? Dude, that frog's a pimp. Fuck your car! Polished and sparkling. Oh, hello, Luna. Don't bother Mr. Facade and the others too much now. Oh, Luna, your house is certainly enjoying being struck by lightning, I must say. Do you still, uh, still intend to live in it? After all, fires are scorching and whatnot. I must admit, it's a real downer on Tasmanly Village's image. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, your maternal grandfather has moved into the new and shiny retirement home. Where is it? Across the way. That, oh, that away. Is that where it's called? Across the way? I believe they had a mare before in hand, yes? Oh, hello! Well, excuse me. Hurry, hurry, haste, haste. <laughs> hurry, hurry, haste. Hurry, haste. Hurry, hurry, haste. Busy, so busy! What the hell? No problem here. I see like a 72 inch TV. There, that is a big, that is a big problem. Oh, look, the books. The wallpaper here is made to look like it's filled with. Wow. Wow, it's a filled bookcase wallpaper. Actually, no, I want to check those photos. No problem here. Except the daughter. She's beautiful. Alright, let's see. Let's head north. Let's see, Crossroad Station is to the north, Cerulean Beach is to the west, and east of here is a nursing home. Never eat, uh, for senior citizens. Oh, and that's south of your house, where lightning keeps striking. Alright, I finally figured out the town's layout. Thanks, man, you're cool. Alright, let's see if we can draw, try see the, uh, let's try talk to him, why not? He's ignoring you. Wow. Go fuck yourself. Alright, let's go see Pop Pop. Hmm. Grandpa! Let me see that ass. Is this the retirement home? I swear to god, if it is. Special nursing home for senior citizens. Old man paradise. It is the retirement home. That's fucking despicable. Having your grandchildren visit is a true cause for happiness. I'm here to visit my grandma. We play games like pin to tail on the leak, hide and go sweep, and the hokey pokey. Oh, hello, Luna. Oh, and Buddy, too. Your grandfather is upstairs in the room on the far left. I... Wow. I haven't seen Gaia lately. How is he? Drip, drip. Drip, drip, drip. I'm gonna pee on you. Um... Oh, Luna, did you come all the way here to see me? Yes. Oh, okay. I was feeling lonely since my grandkids never come see me. But since you, uh, you were nice enough to come see me, I'll give you a little spend of money. It's not much, but here you go. Keep it secret from the grandkids, though. Yeah! I can't keep burdening Lisa forever, but I have a happy box of nice-bodied girls like Nan and Linda here to keep me company. So I'm pretty happy in my own way. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm sorry, Mike, but that's called sexual harassment these days. Wow. <laughs> this is a hard world we live in now. It's like, shit! <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! Oh! Old Froggy! Oh, it's What's-His-Face! Cuckoo, that's a fancy shirt you have. The happy box is giving off some light of sm Ah... What the hell, change? The facade guy has screwed everything up in every possible way. What is he trying to do to the village? I have no idea. He's being a dick. Ribbit, ribbit. Sh sh shave your game, shunny. <laughs> it's an old frog. Yeah, I like it. It's an old froggy. Ribbit. D -d -d Don't worry one bit. I may be old, but I'm still good at shaving as ever. <laughs> oh, Grandpa, you so old. Oh, Luna, how have you been? Ah, uh, lightning hit my mountain cabin a million times, making it impossible to live there anymore. I know it's hard to imagine the lightning was trying to hit my house specifically, but come on, one million times? Literally one million times, was it? Do I still have a map? Why is everything so gray? I don't remember it being like that before. It's so gray. 
Gotta go fast! What's our main motive right now? What are we doing? Are we looking around? I don't recall what we're doing. We're just getting up. I guess it's exploring. This is something we should be doing. Hey, Black Doggy! Bow wow wow! I keep getting hit by lightning! Did someone find- <laughs> Did someone find out I peed on a happy box or something? Good job. <laughs> but bad dog. <laughs> Time really flies. It's almost been half a year since Scamp passed away. I get the feeling it's rare for Scamp's light hand to be so easy forgotten. So in that sense, he's great Scamp's. Poor guy died. Squawk, squawk! I'm not stuffed! I'm alive! I'm pretty alive! Dad, nab it! I'm not stuffed! I'm alive! Pretty alive, Dak Nabbit! Aw, oh, definitely. What the hell is this? This is our train facility. What do you think? Pretty impressive, huh? Burp, Letch. I'm slacking off. It used to be the... It seems to be captivated by the Happy Box. It, this used to be where the, uh, what you call it was. I recount where the, where the cows were. Are they still here? No? What the? What's your guys' problem? You look like you're trying to screw up our formation or something. I'll fucking do it. Oh, you guys want to join the army too? It's gotta uh, eat a lots and lots into your nice big first. Hmm. How shall I put this? Saying things such as uh, this may make me seem a tad rude and unsociable. And for that very reason that I do not prefer to say it aloud, but it's absolutely forced to say what I want to say, I would say. Get out of the damn way. Uh, it's so stuffy in this mask. Phew! Uh, what was another stuffy day? Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Fight, rap, fight, rap, fight, rap. You're distracting me. Go away. Stay out of my way, will ya? Here, I'll give you a riddle to solve so you can go think about it somewhere else. Alright, here's the riddle. Jack had a parakeet named Enza. Jack got sick and his parakeet went missing. Uh, he was about to give up a life, but then, uh, but influenza. Now then, what illness did Jack have? Remember, he was about to give up on life. And then influenza. The answer will come at a later time. Now get out of here. Hope? Love? Loneliness? Hamburgers? Who knows? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z! Alright, let's see. Yeah! Oh, what's going on here? Where's Dopey? Stroke, 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 stroke. I'm Rowey, the newest member of the Tasmanian Boat Club. Aside from the fact that we don't have a boat, everything is going great. Stroke, stroke, stroke! Stroke, stroke, stroke! I'm Paddle, uh, president of Tasmanian Boat Club. Aside from the fact that we don't have a boat, everything is going great. Stroke, stroke, stroke! Stroking that little kids. Hey, shut your mouth! I'm sorry! Alright, let's see. Let's try to head north, I guess. So it looks like... Yeah, it looks like they... Oh! Car guy tried almost... Almost got hit. I love what? You're Luna, right? I've heard uh, bad rumors you're a crybaby. Uh, you don't look like it to me, though. That's because I hardened up. I'm an OG. I'm a police officer, yeah? I'm going to the club Titty Boo to check out the DCMC concert. Uh, I wish uh, I wish work would be end would end already. Titty boo. Remember the real tall guy who used to hang around crossroads? Uh, what was his name again? Beanstalk. Anyways, he was actually so tall he didn't stand out or seem out of all place at all. I've seen him lately though. Tasmanian Central Message Board. Read it. Yes. I saw a remodel on the old ruins of Ushu Castle and turned into Tasmanian Resort Facility. Anonymous. Read another. If you want to ride the train, go to the station. You can ride uh, you can ride the train if you go to the station. The train speeds along. Along speeds the train. Let's go, 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 go! The, fa the factory on the train. Train station attendants. Read another? Sure. Is the, lighthouse helping, is the lightning helping us? Thanks to the lightning, all the dirty old houses are being cleaned away. So in a way, the lightning is helping all of us. That's what I think. For, uh, from a popular citizen. Read more? Alright. Happy boxes are the greatest. Now to develop even bigger screens. Abbott and Abbey. Read another? I wanna. I, I want to be a pig mask too. How could I be one? I know I can be a good one. Please let me be a pig mask. Also, I thought meatloaf is good. Well, goodbye, fried pork kid. After a hard day's work, there's one only one thing to do: spend every last EP you can at Club Titty Bow. Club Titty Bow is a paradise of music and other stuff too. 
Come see DCMC in concert live. Club Titty Boat. Read another? Uh, I have sand in my shoes and I don't know what to do. Somebody do something, Nana. Read another? Why not consider working at the retirement home? Veterans of life are waiting for your kindness. Uh, but please stop quitting one after the other. Retirement home director. Read another? Who's, oh, who, who is world, who in the world is li letter? Try as hard as I might, I just can't remember anything about him. It's, it's keeping me up at night. Mike, read another? Okay. We've been slowly running out of friends at the castle lately. People at Tasmanly, please pass away at, at a faster place if you would be so kind. Thanks, anonymous ghost. Read another. Uh, notice, Scamp has died. That is all. Staff. Read another. Select, uh, select cheerful police officers wanted. Start a new career as an officer at Tasmanly Village Force. Do well and you could even make some pig mass friends. Uh, pusher. Read more? Watch out for chimeras. Strange animals known as chimeras seem to be increasing in numbers today. They are dangerous. Be careful of them from a brave person, okay? Show, uh, show courtesy to Mr. Facade. Uh, there are many ignorant people who are complaining about him. I think that's the very bad thing to do. Tasmanly is nothing without Mr. Facade. Please take this to heart. Isaac, read another. Titaboo News. DM, uh, DCMC, the debut of the new song suit. Desperado. Reckless. Crash. Powerful. Mumble. Sensational. Combo. Guys! No one could stop the DCMC momentum now. Read another. I, uh, I say we remodeled the old ruins at Ocean Castle and turned into... Read another. If you want to ride the train... Alright, okay. I read all of them. Holy shit. Hey, guy. Nick Catman. Hi there! I'm the friendly item depot guy. If you have anything you don't need or want to carry around, I'm glad to hold on for free. The care of items you give me, and I'll return them to you immediately whenever you want them back. Can I hold on something for you? Alright, so he's the... Alright, that's good. That's great. Thanks, you're a good guy. Uh, good guy right there. You know, you, you, see, you never really see good guys. Talk to me. There's a blue mobile house over there. Interesting one that Lex is made. Did you see it there? There's the next one, Nick Cap. Apparently, he holds on to many items that are weighed down. Fuck it. I don't care. Red Roll. Sun Cemetery. Graves have never looked so scenic. No zombies allowed. Zombies did come alive. I hear there's a place along the tracks where magic butterflies flutter to and fro. What? Little open the present. Sprinting bomb. One of the most powerful weapons within this game, and I personally do like them. No problem here. The gravestone is unusually wobbly. So I guess that meant those are ones are have the ability to come alive. Poor Mr. Nip died. Apparently, uh, lightning struck his house 14 times over the course of three years. Poor guy. Oh, Luna. Your old man's always visiting Aurora's grave. It's been mercilessly destroyed. The remnants of, uh, of my humble abode. No tourist. Let's check Mother's grave. Oh, Luna, it's been a while now. You should go, uh, talk with your mom. I. Bark, bark. Wife of Gaia, mother of twins Atticus and Luna, daughter of Alec, made a beautiful Aurora rest in peace, her for all time. It's depressing, but hey. Alright, let's see Ocean Castle. What happened to Launch? I used to sketch up the area. My humble little meatloaf patch. Oh well. It's gone. Oh well. Let's see. I guess this episode is just searching around, huh? Am I gonna get attacked here? Mm. 
Guy is a close up shot. Thank you for your patronage over the years. <laughs> You're welcome, but. What the hell is going on? Oh shit! I didn't. Oh! Uh. Barrel Man! Bottom Doggy! Woo! Barrel Man! Did you just say I leveled up to level 2? Oh no, I'm level 10. Alright, let's see. Why does this just open up? What the heck? Hop. I'm not a ghost, I'm a frog. Do you need something? Why does that just open up all, all of a sudden? Fuck. Huh. That's still locked from the other side. No problem here. Does it appear to move? What what did that open? The floodgates? Who knows? Why is it letting us able to go here? That's the thing what I wanna know. Why does that thing open? An odd dance depicted here. See. Torn up petting lying on the ground. All the fireplaces in the castles are connected via a uh, squeak whip passage. <laughs> Keep it a squeak whip from the ghost, though. Uh, we partied and partied for so long that it's finally getting old. So many more of us gave up in party life, and time went on. <laughs> Oh, so happy you talked to me. Unless we're especially lucky characters like me with our notable personalities often wind up overlooked in the norm, but I'm happy you talked to me. You acknowledge me in other words. Oh, I'm so very happy. Here is it for you. Rotten Eclair. Gross. I've been playing this one song for three years straight. It's like, what am I... It's been fake. You keep playing this song. I was a bit old at this point, but would you like to hear it again anyway? Yes. Even if you forget the small moles on my back and inner thigh, I'll never... Never, never forget you in my lonely room. You're weak tonight, baby. Believe me when I say I don't attach anything to the walls of this room. Like moles or wigs or wall staples. Ooh, ooh, do, do, ooh, do, 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 ooh. No wall staples. Wow, I'm surprised you came here. This castle's so boring now that I could just die. It was the setting of the adventure three years ago, though, but there's nothing uh, all since nothing. In fact, you had to come and talk to me just now. Today would have been the be another empty day leading to another empty tomorrow. So how about a leisurely chat? No, oh, but I want to talk. No, I see. Okay, whatever. Go fuck yourself. No one else? Alright. Can I stop doing that? Hey, that's the Ron and Claire you have there. Please trade with me for this jerky. Alright. See, that guy's a good guy. <laughs> He's a good guy. Alright, that's that for right there. Get out the way. Get out the way, ghost. I'll end you. Hmm. Doesn't seem to appear to be anything along these areas. She's really lonely. Oh, the little boy's naked. Yeah! Doggy, look at my face. Rejuvenated little boy's body. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Boom! Jump down? Nah, I'm all good, man. That wall still looks at me, dude. And I'm still finding it a little hard to be able to comprehend it. Oh, yeah. Jump off. There's nothing to live for. Oh, come on. Jump down? Why jump down? There's a ladder. 
This kid got got hops. He got strong leg muscles. All right, let's see. Daddy O said goodbye to Mother O. I don't know if he's gonna go look for Atticus, or I don't know what's gonna happen next. There's a train right here. Come on now, Jackie, get real. It can't be possibly him. But just think about it. No one's seen nor uh, hit no hair of Dopey since he disappeared three years ago. It gotta be him. It's gotta be Kane. Come on now, that's nonsense. Oh, uh, hey there, Luna. Oh, oh, it's nothing. There's this concert hall named Club Titaboo past a past the factory, and the bass player looks looks kind of like Dopey. Jackie here is convinced he's Dopey. Uh, he looks just like him. I really think we should tell old man Wes. Maybe if we knew for sure, but we only wind up disappointing Wes if it turns out we're wrong. The guy was uh, we saw just uh, just happens to look a lot like Dopey. We don't know any more than that, period. Anyways, time to head home and have some chow while I watch the happy box. You took the words right out of my mouth. I'm starving too. See ya, Luna. Tell Guy I say hi. The train won't be coming for a while. Well, fuck you. Okay? I don't like your services. Don't appreciate it. I've only heard rumors, but... Are you the only one stocking up on food and then walk around without ever eating it? Uh, you really do need to eat, you know. You're still young. How they? How does she know that? Beef jerky. All right, let's head to the left. We have yet to go here. This church area. Oh, a kid from the village. You're so nice and un un unsophisticated. What the? Alright, so I think I'll end off this episode here. I did like 42 minutes of just looking around, seeing the changes that happened in town. And obviously the changes were drastic within the way, and it's very sad that this nice, nice small town turned into some big economic boon city folk kind of town heading in. I kind of understand that when the nice little farming town ends up booming up into something big, because I lived in one and it was terrible. And with that came crime and drugs and terrible people, but... Until next time, my name is Luna, and so is the kid in the game, and Buddy should say goodbye somehow. I don't know, I should have Buddy say goodbye on a recording or something, but until next time, stay frosty.